It was a joyous moment for the immediate past senator representing Edo Central, Senator Clifford Odia, and his family, accompanied by PDP family, dignitaries, friends, and well wishers, as they trooped out in thanksgiving to God to celebrate eight years' successful tenure at the Red Chambers of the National Assembly. The Bishop of Urumi Catholic Diocese, Most Reverend Dr. Donatus Ogun, in a homily thanked God for the life of the ex parliamentarian who had a concurrent outing at the Senate. Bishop Ogun admonished Christians in positions of authorities to see the opportunities as divine assignments from God to improve the living conditions of mankind as he emphasized that every man will give account of his tea worship. The event later shifted to the reception ground. The Deputy Governor, Comrade Philip Schreibu, Speaker Edo State House of Assembly, Blessing Agwebaku, former Speaker, now Member, House of Representatives, and other dignitaries eulogized the sterling leadership quality of Mr. Clifford Odia, who brought development to the people through effective and purposeful legislation. I thank God for what he has done for you. It's a recipe for more that you are expecting from God to do for you. I would believe that he has served in the capacity of um, a senator and that God will give him more opportunity to serve Nigeria. God will continue to strengthen him that he has done well for for his people. This is a man that achieved a lot, attracted good development to his, to his people through constructive lawmaking and today you can even see the way the whole of Asian land is gathered. The elated celebrant said he is fulfilled with his accomplishments while on national assignments. Just as he promised at the beginning of his stadium, he fulfilled. Making it possible for me to be alive today. Of all the opportunities granted me, Especially the mandate to represent those centers at the upper legislative chambers of the National Assembly it was a rare privilege uh, to me. I thank God Almighty. High points of the ceremony was when the celebrant Senator Odia, Deputy Governor, and other dignitaries took to the dance floor in celebration. Ruslan Eborame, ITV News.